here is the app called minimalist to do list and widget so let's install it as you can see this app is quite high in the ratings uh, in the charts and it's got over 20,000 ratings um, this app was featured on the App Store homepage. It's a simple to-do list, reminder, checklist, and task manager that helps you to get things done. Available for iPhone, iPad, and Mac. Uh, intuitive lists, uh, different lists for different purposes. Colored lists, customizable theme, shared list, a simple way to share the same list with others. Widgets, reminders, memo, and subtask. A smart input, auto snooze, focus timer. Uh, cloud syncing, touch ID, face ID. So yeah, here you have that. Uh, uh, interactive widgets. Oh, so that's a lot. Uh, that's a lot of questions right here. And then please name your list. So let's just create it. Uh, save pull down to add and then I want to for example buy milk add a note and then swipe okay so that's quite cool experience uh, and then I just delete so yeah, uh, so I like these gestures. So here I have all this list. It's very, it's really nice design here. And then, uh, yeah, you can just swipe over it to uh, delete it. And then if I have it here, then I just have a settings. Uh, um, then while well, there are a lot of settings where you have widgets um, you can set up widgets here uh, how it looks like sound theme and font language more options uh, so here you have that and then yeah you have multiple lists here uh, wow so really nice gestures in this app and then if you just, and then let's see, for some reason, I don't see the widget yet. Uh, it's kind of weird. So there is some bug with sometimes you just can't add widgets right away for the app. Uh, for some reason, I don't know why is that. Uh, There was other app which is also not working. It's kind of weird, but yeah, I really like the gestures here. And then uh, I can just do something like that. Then you know, I just have list settings. Then I can also see it in the dynamic island, which is quite cool, which is like the top part, top black part in the, in the screen here. And it's available on iPhone 14 Pro and later, I guess. Um, and you have theme and fonts, app icons, badge, cloud cal calendar syncs. You can enable face ID, but okay, that's the price. And then if you want to upgrade, annual is just six dollars, and lifetime subscription is just ten dollars. I actually really like when the apps have lifetime subscription. Uh, that's a really good deal, ten dollars. And then there is a nice tutorial. Then there are some uh, other apps from this developer. So yeah, uh, it's like really cool if, and then I just, uh, I can just delete it or I can just cross it like that if I, from the left, it's pretty cool. Really like that. Uh, so really nice, how to say like user experience here, and then you can just adjust it to it instead of doing like all these check marks. But yeah, that's cool.